Hey everybody, welcome back to another Disney and Pixar Cars diecast video on the Inca Cars channel. And today, I will be taking a look at the Rastakarian from the Disney and Pixar Cars Monster Truck Mater diecast lineup. Now, of course, the Rastakarian was seen in the Disney and Pixar Cars 2 short Monster Truck Mater. Uh, he is one of the um, opponents that Mater had to fight in the whole Monster Truck montage who we of course ended up beating but yeah so here we have the rastakarian very nice i picked this guy up at the flea market almost just about a week before filming this video so very nice of course you see i did already have the rastakarian but you you guys can probably already tell why i need a replacement yeah uh, you just already tell why but, of course, really nicely, alongside getting the Rastakarian at the flea market, I was able to find his, essentially, counterpart in the Rasta Mater. Now, of course, this is a used and kind of beat-up version of him, but I never had this guy, so really happy to be able to pick him up. So, very, very nice to have both Rastakarian-type cars. And... Even just to show you guys cool, I was able to find the cool patio concrete Disney store version. But yeah, so here we have the Rastakarian. So some background, the Rastakarian is of course the car version of a Rastafarian, which is a course from Jamaican uh, origin. It is a, I believe, a religious movement. And um, yeah, and I know some people who of course practice this religious movement and religion do have long like dreadlock hairs kind of like that what the um rastakarian has but yeah very cool so he's got of course on the only walmart only at walmart packaging he's got the monster size little deluxe logo there so of course there's a little artwork of mater on a nice little background then on the back you got a nice little promotion look at that and a couple other diecasts that were re-released during this time, which was 2013 and uh, 14. So yeah, anyways, I'll be right back with the Rastakarian outside of the package. All right, everyone, so here we have the Rastakarian right outside of the package. And this guy is, of course, just as great as he was so many years ago when I got his very first version release. So yeah, of course the Rastakarian, very, very nice. He does have cool kind of like suspending tires a bit because you know they can move. There's a lot more room for them on the bottom there, you see. So of course you can kind of turn right, you can turn left. And yeah, you can make cool poses as well, which is very cool. But yeah, so here we have him, very, very nice. He is a monster truck, of course, monster truck mater. Got the big old tires right there. He's got the gray rims on the inside. Very nice looking. Of course, he has, of course, all the little, like, suspensions and stuff right underneath him. Very nice. Not too detailed, but cool how they did all the little individual stuff in there. Very, very nice. You can see he has a basic body mold. Of course, he is supposed to be a much smaller car, but since they're monster trucks, they have much bigger tires and suspensions. So you can kind of see the fenders right there where the smaller tires would have been. He has a nice angry and determined expression. You can see his mouth right there, angry. Then he's got his eyes in a angry squint type way. Black grill with the headlights right up front. Of course, he does have on the left side of the car the yellow and green with the black dividing line right there, which are the colors of the Jamaican flag. And then, of course, he also has the red on the opposite side here, which I believe is more connecting to the Rastafarian um, religion. So, very, very nice indeed. I like that. You can see it goes green, yellow, red, and on the opposite side here it goes red, yellow, red or green, yellow, red. So nice um, opposite colors. Very, very cool. Nice paint job design. 
not very good um, quality on some of the paint. But, you know, that's kind of to be expected on some of these cars. Can't ever always really be perfect, but not too much of a matter. You also see right there, if we move his little dreadlocks and whatnot, he's got the Rasta Karian little name logo there. Very cool. Pretty much like a wrestling name, similar to The Rock or John Cena. All those guys. Um, yeah, very cool. You can see the entire little <laughs> dreadlocks. Nice, very bendable, rubbery pla uh, pieces here. They're basically like the little... Um, Man, I forget what they're called, but like the little um, hooks that are able to connect and stretch. So that's basically what all these are. Pretty similar to what Mater's tow cable would be like, but there's just numerous them there to kind of act as hair for a car. So he's pretty much one of the very few cars to actually have hair on his body, pretty much. And so, of course, kind of set in there to the side. You can compare him. Here we have the Rasta Mater. So both Rasta versions of the car on screen. I might still have to prefer the Rasta Mater. I might just need to get a more um, refurbished and clean version of him. Very nice. Now, let's kind of go ahead and compare him to Ivy as well. So, you know, of course, Ivy is the Cars on the Road monster truck. Released at the beginning of this year. There she is in size. So yeah, definitely very cool. Much bigger tires on Ivy. Probably a lot more detail on Ivy as well since she's metal and, well, I mean, they're both metal, but since she's Thailand and like that, a lot of detail, but yeah, very cool indeed. Anyways, that is gonna do it on today's review of the Rastakarian. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you guys all enjoyed it. Leave a like on this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.